Tutti is still reacting a little unstable. But with some time, I'm sure we can fix the problem. Maybe three weeks? I believe it's time to renegotiate. My name is Phil Angelino. I work for the FBI. And this is my partner, Bob Conley. We've been friends since high school. He's a little quirky, but he's got some talent. I, on the other hand, I'm a get-it-done-at-all-cost kind of guy. I've been working here for 10 years. I go in the same entrance, and this guy has still got to bust my balls. Carol, come on, you know better than this. I can't let you in. I've been here for five years, and now I'm pink slip. Carol, come on, don't do it. Budgetary cutbacks, outsourcing, economic paradigm shifts. It hits everyone. Hard. Layoffs loom over everyone's head. And the Special Agent of the Month Award goes to Special Agent Willoughby and Special Agent Decor. Good job, Dominic. Thank you. We didn't mention this at all. Why? Because we did most of the background work in the case? Hey, have you heard anything? No. So, you girls have some filing to do? Don't break a nail or anything. Hey, Bob, how long was that server down? What? Two? Three days? Three days, 614,352 corrupted files. Mm. Who's counting? Mm. That was not my fault. Somebody opened a personal email with a virus. Darren Andrews. Don Juan of the IT department. Well, actually, it's information technology specialist. We all know he still pays for his dates. See you later. Yeah. Here she comes. Guys are late. Agents Decoy and Willoughby need these ASAP. Right. Um, hey, listen, listen. What's the news? Are we getting canned here or what? I, I, I don't know anything about that. Even if I did, I couldn't tell you. All we're asking is for you to hint at it somehow. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay, I'll give you a little nod or something. I, I gotta go. Hey, what is it with Janet anyway? Jennifer. It's Jennifer. This is not good. No.
Okay, sure. All right. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> hey, what's up? <clears throat> Years. But we all felt like that. Haven't we all played the same tapes in our head that are telling us no? Angelina, why are you still here? It doesn't matter how hard you work, no matter what you do for a company. It's your time, you're gone. This month's special agent award goes to special agent Willoughby and special agent Dakota. It's just not right. Ow! Ow! Simply execute the change. If I did it, then you can too. Please turn the cassette over for side B. I never wanted to see that look in my father's face again. This isn't working. Can't keep playing it safe. Job back. Inner dialogue. If I did it, then you can too. I am closing a cold case on one of these. I told you you can't. These are not our cases. I told you this is extracurricular. You can't do that. Hesh. I'm gonna solve a cold case on one of these. And then I'm gonna apply for a field agent position. I can use your talent. No way. It'll never happen. No, it has happened. One in a million. Yeah, but it. Working hard? Sir? Yes, sir. Work should never define a man. It is who he believes himself to be that really matters. You gentlemen have a nice day. Way, use a redirect. Get out. No, 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 let, me, let me do it. Let me do it. I never did that. Yeah, thanks. But you're not going to be able to help me get in the databases I got to get into, though. You know, that's going to take a real IT guy. I can do more than you think. Yeah, right. Have a good day. I can. I just don't want to. Mm -hmm. I think Darren is available. Let me give him a call and give me a break. You listen to me. Once we're cut loose, we are never going to have a shot at this. We'll just, we'll find a couple agents to shield us. Now, come on, you gotta go for it, man. Make a choice. I'll file unemployment. It's not definite. Oh, yeah. Right. We have nothing to lose. I'm not doing anything illegal. You're gonna help me. No, I'm not. The Office of Personal Responsibility probes were sunk. So what? Just say the agent. We're helping the agent. That's okay. Now, what's unemployment these days? $367.32 for... Exactly. Me. Yeah. Now, come on. <sighs> what are we gonna do after you hack in? You to access the archives room. Cool. I didn't say I was helping you. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you no, did. No, I didn't. Just did. Oh, ladies. You. Your pink slip is showing. <laughs> Are those the cases? Right there. I'll take half.
We know Darren always stays late. But after that last virus crash, he started doing random system backups. It takes hours, and you can corrupt a whole download if you log in. If Bob would have known, he would have been out of his mind to risk this. I know I'm pushing Bob hard. I just hope he doesn't crack. The FBI database contains hundreds of thousands of criminal profiles. Rapists, murderers, white collar criminals, even you can be listed. Hell, they got John Lennon and he gave peace a chance. Bingo! Whoever's logged into the network, please disconnect now. I'm trying to back up the system. Ow! Whoever's logged into the network, please disconnect now. I'm trying to back up the system. Do you have authorization for all this overtime? <sighs> well, just finished up. <laughs> have a good night. Uh, just a second, mister. Your file's done. <laughs> you are in big trouble, buddy. Hacking into the database? Accessing confidential intel without prior authorization? Whoa, 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 easy, Darren. I couldn't hack into your system. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> you couldn't even pass the IT exam. I happened to have had the flu that day with a 104 degree temperature and they wouldn't let me reschedule. Hey, well tell me, what's the script on a Unix-based server for parity check? Huh? Parity check on unless no parity exists. It's a trick question. <laughs> what script runs a diag with multiple handshaking on a 128-bit encrypted network? 128-bit? Yeah. Handshaking bell. It doesn't exist. <laughs> You're going down, pal, and I mean big time. I'm turning this into security and HR for investigation. Oh, well, you better check with Agents Decoy and Willoughby first. Oh, yeah. Nice try. Hello, I have your event logs. Oh, well, why don't we check with Agent Willoughby right now? I'm sure it's not too late. <laughs> You're bluffing. No, I have his home number. Yeah. <laughs> hello. What? Ah, Mrs. Willoughby. Sorry to bother you so late, but my... Hello? 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 Teamsters. 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 Oh, hey, hey, hey. Extortion. Oh, Teamsters. Ah, maritime case.
illegal import-export activity on several West Coast docks from the Criminal Investigative Unit. Well, we got an inside job case here. Security Division nailed this uh, GS-660 for theft from the VA hospital. What the hell's a GS-660? It's a pharmacist. <clears throat> Man, how do you do that? Force equals mass times acceleration. Newton's second law. Hmm. Phil, we've got to make a decision today. I think we should run with the pharmacist. She's got ties to foreign pharmaceutical companies. The only problem is her photo is missing. Wait a second, Bob. Wait a second. Look at this. You hear this stuff called UD30? Yeah, isn't that that reggae band from London? Surveillance is tracking this stuff called UD30 from some company in China to a shipping company over on Manhattan Boulevard. Let me see your notes. It's the Sui Kai Syndicate. They're infiltrating the Longshoremen's Union, right? But it's part of the maritime case that you pulled before. Hey, this is interesting. Let's run intel on this uh, UD30. UD30. Confidential DD Man, this network is so archaic. I had to compile my own locate daemon with these BSD binaries, and then I had to create a shell script in order to access all the servers at once. <laughs> Darren would die. <laughs> Never mind. Final den. Ah, here we go. UD30. Wow. A powerful aphrodisiac developed by Indian scientists for libido dysfunction. Huh. And though initial tests proved to have significant results. Testing was halted when two of the 500 subjects died from nonspecific aneurysms. Hmm. Fighting amongst the group stirred bitter emotions. Law enforcement in India announced today the brutal slaying of a prominent scientist at a local pharmaceutical company. Large quantities of a substance trade named UD30 was missing. Please? No gun? You could blow up the whole building. You're right. We wouldn't want to blow up anything now, would we? Where's the rest of the UD-30? Please, I have a wife and two children. Where I... is it? It's still too dangerous. Yeah, you were supposed to make it work. You failed. Give me more time, please. You idiot. Stop loafing. Stop! Stop! Ah! Oh, 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 oh. 
That's why CID has surveillance all over this, right? Nyan. Nyan. What? That's where I heard that before. Uh, our pharmacist obtained it. It's, it's a patented B vitamin that causes hot flashes by dilating the capillaries. Well, what do they need that for? Well, to increase blood flow to, for sexual... Uh... Oh, I knew that. And plus, it helps transport the stimulant for greater lengths of time. Nyan is basically a chemically modified version of niacin, which has been patented. Wait, wait a minute. Let me get this straight. So, the federal pharmacist acquires Nyan. She sells it to a Indian pharmaceutical company who makes a Mr. Happy Maker potion. Then it gets ripped off after it fails testing. What's the address on surveillance over there? Uh, here, 420, 420 Manhattan. Manhattan. 420 Manhattan Boulevard. It's a shipping company. It's the same address. Oh. Okay, come on, look, man. This has got to be enough to give agents to Coy and Willoughby, right? Absolutely. You did secure our working arrangements with the Coy and Willoughby, right? Yeah, yeah, they're good. They're golden. They're ready to go. No way. Uh uh. Dog shit. Career killer. You said bring us a case. Case had a closure written on. Yeah. Oh, not That's this dry rot, right, fellas. Oh, hang on a second. This intel sucks. Do I look like I have a bullseye on my forehead? It's a closed case for a reason. Of its once state of the art computer systems from the mid 90s. In a press release today, an FBI spokesman had stated that soon the FBI, CIA, Homeland Security, and other government agencies will be able to share information on just one system. Expect us to put our reputations up for darts with this? No, no, that is what I'm trying to tell you. We, listen, we found information from CID, but we cross reference Look, Angelina. We'd love to help you guys. Just give us a couple of weeks. Three, four. Keep up the good work. Five, six, seven. Uh, Bob. Oh, great. See, look, as soon as that's installed and running, we're toast. Why? They've got everything we've got. Oh. That's great. Maybe Jennifer will give us a referral to Sears. No, wait a minute. Forget that. All right. We need to do an interview. On what? The Suikai? Are you insane? We just need to find the location of UD-30. We'll bring it to surveillance. They'll buy it. Look who's training in D.C. next week. High res flat screen, losers. <laughs> Packing? Yeah, I just picked up a fresh load. You? Yeah, are you crazy? Let's go do this. If work doesn't define a man, then it must be the choices you make. Now take this guy. He couldn't have known. Excuse me. Excuse me, buddy. What are you doing out here? I guess I made some bad choices. Wait, do you know what you're going to say? No. I'm going to say I'm Phil Angelino. Oh, right. I'm going to say I'm Bob Connolly. From the FBI? I'm, yeah, I'm from the FBI. And then show your ID. Yeah, just make sure you hold it up. I'm Bob Connolly from the FBI. No, listen, you got to cover up the civilian part. Just don't let them see that. Okay. You got it? Yeah. Okay, so... Go ahead. I'm Phil Angelino. I'm Bob Connolly. We're from the FBI. Yeah. yeah. Okay? Okay, don't be nervous. What could happen? Come on, let's go.
May I help you, gentlemen? It's after our business hours. Sorry about that. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm Phil Angelino, and this is Bob. Oh, I'm Bob Connolly. We're from the FBI. Sorry. We were just wondering if we could ask the owner of the facility just, just a couple of questions. Will you excuse me for just a moment? Sure. one cheese dicks. Holy hat! Where did you get that? I told you I was packed. Put that away! Do you want to get us sued? Whoa! Oh. Whatever happened, make sure nobody gets some more guns out of that cabinet. How do you expect me to... I've never felt more alive. So close to death. Excuse me. Oh, I'm hit! 
I'm hit. What? Oh. I'm number two. Enough! <laughs> this is getting us nowhere. You should have thought of that before you pulled out the artillery, you biatch. Wait, wait, wait. She wants to negotiate. You're right! I think we got off on the wrong foot. Why don't we all get up and discuss this rationally without the guns? Ha! Ha, mother of God! What did I tell you? Always play it safe. Safe, I tell you. Safe. Everyone makes mistakes. It's who they become that's important. The key. Come and get it. Huh? Hey, Bob. Come on. Let's get out of here, huh? Yes! Tell to decoy and Willoughby. Right, okay, and I'm gonna say the guy took the first swing, all right? Gentlemen. Man knocks on the door to God, asking for enlightenment. Man awakens when he sees he is knocking from the inside. SWAT commander was released from the hospital this morning. Diagnosis? Hyperextended erectile dysfunction. The exhaust fan had extracted the UD-30. Unfortunately for us, he was the only one affected.
Connolly and Angelina. In all my years, I've never seen anything like this. Who do you two think you are? The Lone Ranger and Tonto? <laughs> Tonto. You've turned this department on its ass. You two ever hear of protocol? Sir, we did present the intel to... Who told you to stand down? And now I have to answer to the brass as to why my top field agents couldn't clear this case while two civilians blew it wide open. How do you think that makes me look to my superiors? Sir, it's my fault. I I'm responsible. Oh, really, Angelina? Angelino! Sir. Well, Angelino, what I'd really like to do is wring your necks. But I'm afraid that if I press this issue, it may raise some eyebrows. I would say work well done if I didn't feel like my balls were being squeezed. Sorry. We've been surveilling this place for months, and we never could get any hard evidence until now. A perfectly matched immersion oil. It's an old diamond smuggling trick. Thanks to you guys. Now we know their M.O. Not bad. So congratulations, you just earned your jobs back. Now get back to work. But sir, these guys are totally incompetent. Connolly didn't even pass his IT certification. I told you I had a fever that day. Sir, we got this far. We both want to be field agent candidates. Sir, we possess all the qualities that are required by this agency. Really? Yes, yes sir. sir. Son, this is not support work. We are truly aware of that now, sir. And you want a shot? Yes, yes sir. sir. No way! But, sir, these, these guys... Probably crazy for saying this. All right. The woman that escaped. We think she may be the link to the Chun and Sui Kai syndicates. I want you to find her and report directly to me and don't screw this up. This will be probation. You get her and we'll talk about this agent position. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Get the Koi and Willoughby up here. Stack. You should have handled this. Mr. Chun is very disappointed. This was your responsibility. You disgrace us! Dead! I said we'll get it back. Those FBI guys will go down, and Mr. Chun will get his money. Yacha, she's going down for payback. Hey, you know what I'm gonna... Guys, oh my gosh, hey, everybody wants to know. Everybody wants to know what happened in there. No, it doesn't just happen. Uh, have an undercover Did months. you guys get fired? It's no, really... well, it's like... It's we really... had this me... My bad. No, go ahead. They are trained chimps. It's the inconceivable. We're on special assignment. They want us to go after that woman. Hey, We'll keep you posted. There is no woman. Oh. Oh. Oh, right. Right. Hey, but I wanted to thank you. What? Well, for that heads up in there. That was great. It was, it was my pleasure. <laughs> You've got blue eyes. I, I've never noticed that before. Hi. Hi. You know, we, we really should get together to talk For about dinner? this file. Or a movie? I, 
Look, I don't want to be too forward here. Phil, no, no, I, I, I think we should go. No, no, that would that would be great. Really? Yeah. Now, now. Did you like action? Comedy? Jackie Chan. Woody Allen. Okay, I'm gonna go get the car. How about, um, do you like baseball? Oh my gosh, I love baseball. You love baseball? I love baseball. Are you Angels kidding are my favorite team. Oh, are you serious? Yeah, I'm oh, that's, serious. Yeah, we can go to a game maybe uh, some Saturday. But I'm a Yankee fan now. No. Yes. No. Yeah, Yankees. It is coast. all about, how can you live in Los Angeles and not be all about the Angels? Well, because I'm from the East Coast. Our next assignment, find that GS660. That kick to the chest left its mark. Boy, I'm looking forward to busting her. Now if we can only find her.